Well, we are in the midst of a special week-long series with the television voice of the Cubs, Len Casper. Yesterday, we heard about his beginnings with the Cubs. Now, tonight, we will hear about his relationship with some of the managers he's worked with in today's conversation with Len Casper. You know, I've been really uh, lucky in that I've been around some really interesting managers. Uh, when I was uh, in Milwaukee, before I actually did games uh, uh, broadcasting, I covered the Brewers. Phil Garner uh, was a longtime manager there, and uh, they call him Scrap Iron. And uh, he, uh, he was a very brutally honest guy, and I, I got along well with him. Uh, Jeff Torborg in Florida, and then Jack McKeon, who uh, always seemed to have a cigar around him when, uh, when he was telling stories. And then I got to the Cubs, Dusty Baker, uh, Lou Pinella. Uh, and then Joe Madden, who, you know, for five years was on top of the world as the Cubs manager. And now David Ross, whom I knew well as a player, now taking over uh, as a first-time manager. I've been really blessed in, in being around some, some great baseball lifers and uh, too many stories to tell. And most of them, unfortunately, I probably couldn't tell publicly. Well, thank you for preserving my job. I appreciate that. Um, how about David Ross? What are your thoughts on him? And uh, what do you expect from him when we get going? What we'll see from him with uh, the Cubs this season? David Ross was kind of born to be a manager. And the best compliment I could pay him this spring in the short time we were down there is that he's the same guy now as a manager as he was as a player. And that may sound strange, but really, when you change positions in this business, you don't want to see someone change who they are fundamentally because the reason he got hired is because he's David Ross. Now, having said that, he really looked the part. Uh, he admits that he doesn't know everything, and he's got a really good coaching staff around him, including uh, the new bench coach, Andy Green, uh, who just finished a four-year stint as the manager of the San Diego Padres, and I think David uh, relied on him a lot in spring training and will do so if and when our season starts. Uh, I don't worry at all about him being able to uh, be tough on, on his former teammates when necessary and make sure that you know they're doing all the right things. So I'm, I'm really intrigued to see how it goes with David at the helm. And uh, you know that's another reason why I want to get this thing going as quickly as possible.